Western Highland Seventh Day Adventist Mission officially opened a new facility at Kumbo in the Upper Nebilia area, the Tambul Nebilia district, la district, last week. The facility was built at a cost of 700,000 Kina funding, which was jointly provided by the SDA mission through its health services and Strong in People, Strong in Nation program of the Australian government. Jack Tame has more from Mount Hagen. Health issues for these people, including people living with disability, have been a real challenge for many years, but now they are happy. Before, me not looking this program. Now I'm making me easy to Me at long, buy a car or drive only go long. I was sick of this name at long. Now me got big problems through because I was sick of come from a place below me now. Minister Solomon Paul, pastor of Combo Church, and the man who has initiated the project said he had met many sick people during his pastoral visits, and this scenario had triggered him to put up a health facility to help them. Minister Paul further thanked the stakeholders who have helped him and in a special way the SDA Western Islands Mission and SPSN for their partnership in counterfunding by completing the project successfully. We are so blessed to have you people in the country and especially coming down this low to meet the needs of the simple people. You can see what it is like with the people here. They really need it. What they are doing here, it's, it's a show of their appreciation for what the people of Australia and the uh, Osaid plus the church is doing in partnership. Minister Paul also pointed out that there is a need to build a ward for mothers and a house for a community health worker in the future. In the meantime, the facility was officially opened by the Minister for Labour, Industry and local member Bensman Poponawa. Mr. Poponawa in his speech has staying the SPSN program and the Western Highlands SDA mission for putting up the facility together in his district. So is the church. Your efforts and your uh, resources that you have been putting here is a prime example of what the government is saying now. So people of my, like partner with the people of churches. Minister Poponau presented a cheque of 15,000 kina to the facility and Mount Gilwa local level government president Michael Mai made a commitment of 10,000 kina on behalf of the governor of Western Highlands by